Hello and welcome back to my channel. My name is Samantha. I hope that you all had a fantastic Christmas and with that in mind I visited the Boxing Day or After Christmas sales yesterday and today I'm going to be sharing with you everything that I picked up. I've got products from Boots, Primark and Next and I'm going to start off with this. It's from Laura Ashley and it's from Boots that we're starting with first of all. So it's the Laura Ashley range and it's the Garden Bloom Hand and Nail Cream and it has Shea Butter. Now each hand product, I well, when I'm going to use a hand product a lot, then I really like it to have Shea Butter in there because um, it really is nourishing for my hands. Um, this was six pounds reduced to three. I really love the packaging on this. Obviously, Garden Bloom, so it's all very floral in design, and I really love that. So it's floral all the way round. Now you're getting 130 ml of product here for three pounds, which I didn't think was too bad, and they had lots of these left. So all you have to do is pull on the ribbon, and that then shows you the product. And again, that floral design is then on the inner packaging of the product. I really love it. Um, so like I say, you're getting 130 ml of product. This has shea butter. I've already tested it. Um, it's got a little screw top there. What I'll do is I'll squeeze a little bit out. Now it's not uh, liquidy and it's not really, really thick. It's actually in the middle and you'll see that. So it's like that. So it is fairly thick, which I really like in a hand cream. Um, and I've already tested this, like I say, and it really does sink into the skin effortlessly. Um, it smells absolutely beautiful. If you like floral fragrances, you're going to love this. And it just smells beautiful. Um, it also sinks into the skin really, really quickly and really well. And again, that's how I know that it's going to be a really good hand cream. I've got to head back um, tonight, so I'm going to probably pick up some more of these because I'm so impressed with it. And for £3, you cannot beat it. The next product is from the range Champneys, and it says the original Champneys Health Spa. It's a set that I've actually already taken out of the packaging because I've used it today, and I hope it doesn't slip from my hand. There we go. They look like this. So this is all from one um, Christmas package. Um, or set and this retailed for £16 reduced to eight so uh, they're just under three pounds each um, for these and you're getting 300 ml of product now they're bubble bath and I thought that this was actually different you know you're not tipping in necessarily one of the long um, containers and these are like tubs I really like the design of these they look absolutely beautiful in the bathroom now each one is different so this one is the deeper purple and it says cloud nine indulgent bubble heaven so first of all, I really love the packaging. It looks stunning. Like I say, it looks good in the bathroom. You have a screw top lid, and then you have all of this bubble bath inside. Now, I expected it to, when I poured it under the running tap, the whole lot to fall out, but it doesn't. It actually falls out very nicely, and there's just a certain amount or just enough product that falls out um, for the bubble bath. So I was obviously concerned about that because it is new to me, but it worked really, really well. Now, I didn't use this one today, but I think this is probably going to be one of my favorites, this one, so Cloud Nine. It just smells really, oh, beautiful. It's quite exotic, um, but powdery at the same time. It's a um, little bit of a deep note rather than, you know, fresh and or floral, but it is stunning. Um, a bit oriental, so I suppose if you like your oriental scents, you're going to love this one. So that's the first one. Then there's this one called A Summer Dream, and it's pink. So you've got the like deep purple or magenta. Then you've got this one called A Summer Dream. And yeah, again, it says Rewarding Bubble Heaven. Again, let's, um, again, you get all that product. This one is much more floral um, with a little bit of lemon uh, um, like seagrass added into that one and then the last one is the one that I used today so this one is much more of your violet and this one is heavenly days uh, relaxing bubble heaven and 
again it unscrews just like the rest you can see that I've used a little bit of this oh again it's floral but it's not as floral as the pink oh it's just beautiful and it made the whole upstairs smell stunning um, but yeah really really love that so like I say these were eight pounds love those now the last three products are all the same my favorite is a sanctuary spa and when I came upon these my son actually bought me one um, then I actually bought one with my points um, and then I bought another one for myself um, well they're all for myself but I I suppose I paid just for one um, so yeah that was so so lovely of my son to do that he was looking for some deals as well and what is it they had quite a lot actually from this range um, and I've already used some of these products but it's a jar of products so this is the one that I've used I'll show you one that I haven't in a moment because it does come with something else that I've already used and it's in my bathroom because it's wet and it will drip everywhere um, so I really love the jar it's a really um, good quality glass you can feel that it's weighty um, and I really love the design sorry I caught that with my ring really love that I also love the elasticated ribbon you know it's not something that you have to keep worrying about tying so it's elasticated it comes off um, but I really like that anyway I love orange so when let me just take the lid off if I can now with my um, hands that I have the uh, cream on so inside you get a foaming bath soak for 75 mil so that is the bath soak so if you're new to sanctuary spa or if like me you're not new to it but you love it this is the time to stock up this is the body wash love that now they did have the rose uh, fragrance set and the jar was bigger and had bigger products but this is my favorite the original scent i absolutely love it it's warming but fresh at the same time and it makes me feel very very clean you know that after you've had a shower or bath kind of feeling this is the body lotion these all have a 75 ml of product I've used this today and this again um, is a favorite and it's the hand cream now this is 30 ml of hand cream there was no, um, I've forgotten what, a scrub, that's it. There was no scrub in this one. There was in the rose, and actually this is that's what prompted me to pick this one up rather than the rose-scented jar, even though um, it had larger products. It was three pounds more expensive. But I went with this, one, because of the scent, um, two, because of the hand cream, and three, because it didn't have the body scrub. Total waste of product for me. I never really use it. Well, I never use it. Um, but the hand cream I've already used. Now I have uh, purchased hand cream from this brand before and always been disappointed with the scent. It's totally different, but this isn't. If you like the original scent, um, like this, the orange um, colored products, then you're going to love this because the hand cream actually smells, it's got that original scent. You also get one of those body puffs in here as well. So that's the first one. Let me just pop the lid on. So that's without the puff. Just pop it down. And this is what it looks like in the store. So this was 10 pounds reduced to five, which I think is so good. So even after you've used all of the products, you can see that body puff there. Um, you've got the jar. And like I say, I picked up three. So that's the second one. And then this is the third one. So that's all three well all three jars and all of the products that I picked up from Boots. I'm just going to sit back a little bit because I'm now going to share with you the products from Next that I picked up in their sale. So um, I love Next sale, it's always amazing, I love their clothing. I have some clothing from Next that are years old, it never goes out of style, it's always very classic and they always incorporate the latest fashions into their clothing but it's not just for that season because they're so well made and I just love it. The first thing, because I do love their jewellery as well, I picked up a pair of earrings and these were four pounds and I really love the fact that there is like a, there's a bead there but it's got all glitter in it and I thought these are pink, they're gorgeous, they're four pounds, reduced from 12, um, you can't beat it. Their jewellery is usually 
well it is expensive but I thought I'll pick that up I also picked up this jumper um, I actually nearly uh, purchased it for full price um, a couple of weeks ago and it was originally £35 um, down to £17.50 so I thought I'm going to pick it up it's got a bardo style neck it's also got balloon sleeves with a cuff which I really love and they're also three quarter length for me um, which is um, it looks very flattering absolutely gorgeous but I just love the pearls in fact I've got it back to front because I just love the pearls now the pearls on the arms are all over so you can see that but also they're on the front as well but not on the back and I just really loved it now it's a regular length jumper it's just beautiful I wish I'd have got it in a bigger size I picked it up in 14 thinking that that was big enough um, it is big um, but I do like my jumpers very oversized but this is absolutely fine I might just take it with me just so just to see if I can pick up a bigger size but it is just beautiful and it's in blush one of my favorite colors to wear the next product I didn't get lots and lots of items um, I just got a handful of products that really you know did I wanted basically and spoke to me this is a coat again that I've had my eye on for a while it's actually quite thick for a coat again and I could not believe the price now this was actually 45 uh, pounds the price was 45 pounds and it was reduced to 13 pounds 50 um, I couldn't believe it now this is a coat again so it does come mid thigh but it's I just love the pattern I think it will go through to spring it's pink and fuchsia and I just absolutely love it it's beautiful and it's so well made it's also got pockets it doesn't have any buttons or anything it is a coat again but love that and then the last item that I had to pick up when I saw it I thought oh my goodness love this is this it's a velvet um like bomber jacket or puffer coat but it's velvet it's beautiful it's got a high neck here it was 70 pounds reduced to 30 so i had to get this it's just stunning it comes to your bottom um and i picked it up in size 16 thinking I'm going to give it a go but I think this is going to be too big but it is a little bit oversized but it really works so I love that so so much so when I'm taking puppy for a walk I'm going to be nice and warm okay so that's everything from next now from Primark the first thing that I picked up was and I picked up two pairs of these my my the same boots that I always pick up because I love them I can't wear heels because of my back but these are stunning I love these they look good with my skinny jeans and I've got quite a number of colors where yeah I've got lots of colors actually but I um, bought out brought out sorry these blush or baby pink um what they call it nude so i picked these up and these were only three pounds reduced from eight i also picked up the burgundy i haven't got them here because they're in a bag downstairs with the receipt now they actually had this on it which says size five um, um but they've size three so i've got them in the bag ready to take back tonight and return for hopefully my size if they haven't all gone um, but yeah I was really disappointed when I got home I should have checked but that it was starting to get crowded you know what it's like especially in Primark so I saw this size 5 and I thought yeah I'm gonna get it and of course went got home to try them on and they were size 3 I should have realized from the size but you can imagine what I was like with um, a sale <laughs> I was running around but anyway these I picked up I love them they're nude then I picked up these, and you would have seen these before. They're a pair of beautiful, beautiful Cavajon earrings. They're pink. They look like they're marbled a little bit, but they were three pounds, as you can see, reduced to one. I've already got these in this colour. I've got them in, and they're calling this um, blush. I've also got them in um, yellow, and I think green. Um, and all those colours were on offer for a pound as well. But I picked up another pair of the pink because I love them so, so much. 
Then, this wasn't in the sale, but I picked this up. Now, of course, I love these jumpers. This is extra large. I actually had to wash this because I picked this up. The tag had been removed, but someone had already worn it. You can tell, can't you, because it smelt a lot of perfume and I could just tell that someone had worn it um, So and returned it, taking the tag off. So I've washed this and I absolutely love it. And you'll see me wearing a lot of these, especially black. I've got now a couple. Now I wore a um, the scarf yesterday with this in this colour um, with a brown tweed jacket. Doesn't sound like it would work, but it really did. And when I saw this um, colour, in Primark I thought I'm going to get it like I say it's not on sale but it's exactly the same jumper that I'm wearing I always get extra large so it's not really tight and they're calling this pink so it's quite a vibrant bright pink but now Christmas is over I really want spring <laughs> so I'm thinking ahead with the coat again from next and this beautiful jumper and I just think it's gonna liven up well make me feel a little bit more lively in these very dark um coming january and february winter months so yeah really love that and that was six pounds then i picked up this now i'm not sure if i'm going to return this everything else is in the sale but i'm not sure if i'm going to return this because it looked stunning in the store and you know what it's like when you're running around trying to hunt out a bargain and you pick up items sometimes that you might not necessarily um wear um, but you pick them up anyway just to try at home and this is what I've done with this but I don't like the knit of it and it's a jumper and I picked it up in large and it's one of those beautiful fluffy jumpers which I love but it's striped and it's like this marl effect grey and white there then you've got cream and then you've got purple but for some reason it just feels on the grey marl it just feels really flimsy and not very nice compared to the other fluffy jumpers that Primark um, do they said that this was 13 pounds down to five now the um, cream and the purple feel really good but it's just the marl it just feels like it's going to stretch really badly um, but do I keep it for five pounds I'm not quite sure again like I say I might just take it with me just to see if I can pick up something else but the cream and the purple feels great it's just that mild bit feels like you know it's it's going to stretch quite badly now the next two items are exactly the same color but i love this so much last year i actually had the v-necked fluffy version um, i was hesitating with the new crew neck but i thought because this is discounted so this was discounted from 10 pounds down to five and it's one of their new style fluffy jumpers um, they're a little bit more boxy this year i picked up the cream um, in this color but in this wool but it had a v-neck which i love but they've only got that and raw blue i think this year and then they've got um this new like crew neck version so i thought i'm going to try it for five pounds and it actually looks really good the crew neck only it doesn't come up as high as this it sort of comes there so yeah really really like it it's got long sleeves it just looks stunning on but like i say it's quite boxy and I picked up the extra large because I do like, like I said, my these kind of jumpers to be big and oversized. But I love this grey colour so, so much. So that was £5. And I've had my eye on this for a while. So it's in exactly the same wool, exactly the same colour, but it's actually a jumper dress. Um, so again, you've got the sleeves like that. It's a round neck, you know, a regular neck um, this time. But... It goes on and on and on because it is a jumper dress. And I thought um, when, before I lost the weight, I never felt like I could wear jumper dresses because even when I picked up extra large, it just made me, well, it didn't make me feel very good about myself. Now I've lost the weight. I've actually picked it up in large. Um, I actually wanted medium, but I picked it up in large by mistake and it is actually very, very nice. I like it on me. Um, it doesn't 
and I think I've done the right thing getting the large because it doesn't cling to where I don't want it to cling if you know what I mean really love it it looks great with leggings and I'm very very pleased that I picked it up now this one was reduced from 15 pounds down to seven so because of these um you know half price or less it really does let me try products or try like this you know a jumper dress for less than half the price and if i don't wear it that much you know i don't feel bad about it but i think i will it looked really good with leggings and it is in my favorite color and wool from primark and in these fluffy jumpers so that is everything that i picked up from the sale um I also picked up Theo a, another coat. I can't believe that I actually picked up extra small um, and now he's in small. So I picked up one of those, but obviously it wasn't in the sale, so I, I'm not showing you that. Um, but yeah, um, that's everything that I picked up yesterday. Um, I've got to go back because obviously the boots are, three, no, not three sizes, two sizes too small. So I've got to go back. Like I say, I may return the pearl jumper for a larger size. And I think I'll keep the jumper dress in the large just because it's nice, isn't it? When you're at home to slouch about, you don't want anything too figure hugging. And obviously we've got New Year to get through now with the food. <laughs> so I'm being good this week. Next week, maybe a different story. And also it's my birthday coming up as well. Um, but yeah, that's everything I picked up in the sales. I hope that it's helped you if you're heading into this or out into the sales or out to the sales in the next couple of days like i said at the beginning of this video i really hope that you all had a fantastic christmas and obviously we're now heading into the new year um so which i can't quite i still can't quite believe 2019 i have to keep telling myself 2019 um to get used to it but i would love your thoughts on the products what was your favorite piece or favorite product from what i have hauled um is there any products that i have shared with you that you've received that you love um, perhaps you received some of these for christmas gifts i would love your thoughts on that um obviously your comments in general are very very welcome i won't be doing thank you thursday this week i'll probably now keep it for next week just because it's a little bit of a funny time isn't it so i'm going to start it up again next week um because i've just realized it's thursday but you know you you can't quite the days yeah i'm forgetting which day of the week it is anyway i'll do that again next week start that again next week and of course if you have just stumbled across my channel i would love it if you subscribed and joined the friendship circle um especially now we're heading into the new year and of course i do share videos every single day apart from sundays so um well apart from yesterday i thought i'd give myself a little bit of a treat and a day off especially with with uh, heading to the sales but anyway until tomorrow thank you so so much for watching as always thank you bye